Booth table areas, you're welcome to start cleaning up now. Um, please feel free to sit during the duration of Blue Moon Bus. Everything is free for you guys. Hello everyone, thank you for coming out to see us Moon Fest. We are your culture chairs, I'm Olivia. Yeah. I'm Madison. I'm Kelly. I'm Kelly! I'm Kelly! <laughs> our performers have been working really hard this past month to bring the show to life. We thank you all for coming out to support our performers and we hope you're, exci we hope you're excited for what's to come. I hope you guys had a chance to go around to all the booths and visit the CIOs and learn about them. Hold on to your raffle tickets because you just might be our lucky winner today. Woo! Um, is this just your first time at Bowman Fest? Welcome! Bowman Fest is CSA's very own celebration in honor of the Mid-Autumn Festival. And what we do during the Mid-Autumn Festival is we celebrate community by eating food with friends and family and enjoying the transition of season together. Okay, just a quick reminder before the performances and skit performances begin. Um, you're welcome to hype up the audience when they're performing, but please be quiet while the poster chairs are emceeing and the skit people are acting because we want to hear their voices. Thank you. All right, so to get started for our very first performance today, we have the performance of their lives from our actors and actresses. Mid-Autumn Festival. What's that? Ta-da! You may be wondering what's in my hand. It's a moon cake. What the Mid-Autumn Festival is all about. Wait, do you know what the Mid-Autumn Festival is actually about? Isn't it just about eating moon cake? Let me give you a quick history lesson. The moon cake played an important role a few hundred years ago in China during the Wan Dynasty when China was ruled by the oppressive Mongol state. Yeah. 
That's $25 for the UVA bookstore. Yes, Our next prize is $25 for the Virginian. It's a great restaurant. Hopefully you guys will win. Three zero nine nine three eight. Come up and get your gift card. Enjoy. Our last gift card for this round. Again, make sure to buy different raffle tickets for the next round of gift cards. And here we go. Three zero nine nine three seven. Come up and get your gift card. That is twenty dollars for Afghan Kebab. Great restaurant close to Lambeth, so and that's all the tickets and raffles for this round. Make sure to stop by, buy some tickets if you want to get a chance for the next round. Thank you so much. Wow, I wish I won some of those prizes. Remember, there's one more raffle later on in the show, so please keep your ticket, and hopefully your raffle number will be picked next. Now, let's get back to our wonderful skip performers. Let's see how the Rebels are playing for our prize. So while the people were celebrating, the rebels and Lu Bo Wen, Drew Ram John's military counselor, got in for a secret meeting. General Drew was in danger, and now was the time to act. Dun dun dun. <laughs> what? I thought we needed some sound effects. We need to do something, and fast. But how? The government keeps reading all of our secret messages. Hmm. We could hide messages in a moon cave. That's a dumb idea. Just think about it. You know what? That's a great idea. The moon cave could be a great way to hide messages from the government. So the rebels hid slips of paper in the moon caves and delivered them to families all across China, asking them to support them on the uprising on October 22nd. Wait, that's the day of Minar Festival. They're going to miss all the celebration. I think they have bigger things to worry about. They also asked General Drew's wife to deliver a milk to General Drew himself, informing him of the date. Oh, oh. oh, oh. oh, oh. are you alright? Yes, I am. Yes, I know you're okay. Wow, love is so beautiful. Oh my god, you're so true. Speaking of love, 
Um, I wonder what's going on with our loving couple from Skid. to see you, darling. <laughs> Don't we have a rebellion to get to? Oh, right. All right. Oh, uh, sorry. sorry. Here, take this milk cake. Break it in half. Excellent. Go home now. I must be ready on October 22nd for the uprising.
wow, I always knew they could win. I mean, come on, their power, their speed, their intensity. Their... Okay, okay, I think they get it. Let's here for our second and final set of raffles. Woo, come on, Carly, let's go. Woo! Thank you, Coulter. <laughs> um, so to start off the second round, we'll be giving away two free Kung Fu tea drinks. Drum roll, please. One, six, six, three, eight, one. Don't be shy. Say it again. One, six, six, three, eight, one. Okay, I'll choose again. And then for the second one, it's a $25 gift card to the best restaurant on the corner, which is Bodo's. So. One six six three eighty nine. Okay. Okay. I'll choose that one again too. Oh. oh, oh, oh. And then the next one is three Ben and Jerry's punch cards, so you can get some free scoops. With them. Okay, three zero nine nine three five. Who is it? And then for the last one of the day, save the best for last, it's a $50 Domo gift card. <laughs> okay. Can I get a drum roll, please? Okay. This one is 309944. Next time you go to Dome, I'll hook me up. <laughs> and that's it for Ruffles. Thank you guys. Well, that's all for Ruffles. But we still have another contest. Can we welcome PR to announce the winners of the PR contest? Get it, 
drum roll, please. Cheryl Vine. Uh, congratulations to these two people. Thank you so much to everyone who participated, and thank you for coming out to Full Moon Fest. We'll be giving the winners their prizes after at the mess. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah, just sit still for five to ten minutes. Thank you guys. Yeah. Also, there's trash bags around the area. Please